hey guys <clears throat> how are we feeling happy thursday hi babies <laughs> yes you on time today period how we doing What's up, cat? Hello, everyone. How are we feeling? Yes, you are early. Shout out to being early. Because I ain't going to be on that long. Just an hour. Hi. Got incense? I'm well. Oh, okay, okay, thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> that makes me feel good. What's up, baby? Y'all got incense? <laughs> spark your incense. Because I'm going to spark my incense. <laughs> You burnt out, Cheryl. She said, Ma is on the way. Show. Let me move this a little bit closer. Y'all know I got to... So I can be able to be off screen. You know? Oh, emotional. Why are you emotional, baby? Hi. What's up, man? Well, I'm about to spark my incense. So we can go ahead and get started. <laughs> okay. I'm doing well. I'm doing well. How about you, Cheryl? Shout out to the incense being sparked, Lord. <laughs> All right, let's see what's going on with y'all. Let's tap in, let's tap in, let's tap in. Call them on my ancestors, spirit guides, angels, and archangels. Off of my highest good and highest light. Please provide me the most clearest, most accurate, most concise messages for my TikTok collective. Or just for my viewers in general. You know what's going on. You need Palo Santo. Better get some. Damn, pretty brown eyes. Why is that going on? I'm well, Elizabeth. How are you? Hey, Michelle, I'm good. How are you? What's up, June? I hope you enjoyed that reading, Raven. All right, let's get started. Oh, thank you, T-Dub. All right. Let's tap in. We're going to start off with my deck. Yeah. We're going to start off with my Oracle deck. I can have monitoring spirits. I just seen a fucking gnat out of nowhere. <coughs> hey, friend. Hey, Sam. What's up, Liv? What's up, everyone? What's up? What's up? What's up? 
I'm well. How are you? Let's go ahead and tap in and see what's going on with y'all. Let's see what's going on with y'all. See what's going on with this Hey. You right on time. Bear with me by Tiana Taylor. Don't you see that I got baggage? My heart's way too much to manage. So somebody could want you to bear with them when it comes to something. Or you are asking somebody to bear with you. Somebody can be feeling too tired to do something or something like that. So you're just like, bear with me, Lord, okay? <laughs> What's up, Morton? Oh, hey, Mystic Davis. Welcome in, baby. I hope you enjoy the live. Yeah. Also, I feel like a love interest can be telling you to bear with them. Okay? They're telling you to bear with them. That you, you'll be together soon. They're just working on some things. Or they'll be making time soon or something like that. Bear with them though. Alright, what else? Alright. And someone is like, bear with me, bear with me. Someone's going to give you exactly what you need, even extra, if you bear with them. Okay. Extra um by Larry June is um. So, yeah. Money in my pocket, I got extra of them. Whole lot of whips, I got extra of them. <laughs> A couple condos, I got extra of them. Yeah, so somebody working on some shit in order to... Take on extra, give you extra, whatever. All right, because somebody could want to give you the world. Something. All right, give me some more. I've been hurt before. So somebody can want you to bear with them in their emotions. Bear with them when it comes to moving forward in this connection. So we'll be wanting to take it slow. Number 3033 is significant. What else is going on in the energy? You remind me of 90s R&B love and truth is by Fantasia. I never got over you. So I kind of feel like someone is asking you to bear with them when it comes to their emotions of their past because they never got over it and they're still working through it. But they're not getting over you either. They're not moving on from you. Somebody's just having a hard time working through their past or whatever hurt that they've been carrying. I'm feeling you like you're feeling me. It's just harder for me to express that. Yeah. Again, it's coming up underneath, uh, I've been hurt before. So, though, though that they feel the same way for you, it's just harder for them to actually express that because they feel like they're having a hard time putting their guard down due to just past energy. Not Somebody got trust issues. That's what it's really giving. Somebody got trust issues. But I feel like this person is going to get, they're going to come off at top. Because I'm hearing, well, I'm seeing um, I'm stronger than my anxiety. I am the success story. So they're going to come out on top. 
This could also be you as well. You working through your past hurts and stuff like that. You could be learning how to be more vulnerable. Because somebody wants to be open to receive that type of love that reminds them of our 90s R&B. Okay. Tell me more. What else is going on in energy? So some of you guys could be recognizing that you've been hurt. You can be recognizing that you've held on to something from your past as well. If it's not you, it's this person. But I feel like some of you guys could be slightly closed off to love. You could not be letting anybody in. And I feel like it's because you're not really realizing that there's some things in your past that you really have not moved past. You say you want this 90s R&B love, but you're still holding on things from the past. Somebody can be a terrace, a terrace, a Taurus. Okay, so something about a terrace. A parent, a parent. It looks like those little. Let me see. Hold on. So what I'm thinking is, yeah. Okay, like a patio. Some of y'all could have been on the patio or something like that. All right, something about somebody's, yeah, patio. But that's not the word I was trying to say, but yeah. So something about a patio. Okay, I daydream about what our life would be like together. Hey. Did I meant to, yeah, I meant to say Taurus. Aww. I'm going to get more on my YouTube shit. Check out the live readings. I've been posting lives on there, so you may have to click the live um, tab. Okay. Yeah, but if this is someone that you are dealing with, um, this is someone who definitely daydreams about what it would be like if you guys were to end up together and stuff like that. I feel like this person loves the way that you love on them. But it's just something about their past that keeps them slightly guarded. I do feel like they're slowly but surely letting their guard down, but... You can tell that this person is moving the way that they're moving due to whatever it is that they're holding on to or whatever they've been through, you know. This person can also have um, insecurity issues. They definitely feel a lot for you than you know. They feel like you give them butterflies. They always... Someone gets nervous around you. But someone would be trying to make it seem like it's it's something else when it's not. <laughs> this person really wants a future with you. But look, I can't get over my passes at the top of the deck. And what I was manipulating you at the bottom of the deck. They were underneath that is almost you'd have my kids. So it's give this energy like they know they've seen a life with you and stuff like that. But they try to play it off and make it seem like that's not what they were seeing because they were still harp harping on their past, still holding on to their past. It's, it definitely gives denial. This person was trying to be in denial of their own feelings when they're really all about you. <laughs> They're just used to people who be running game. They're not used to this authenticity that you show them, that you offer them. Your genuinity. Okay. Well. So I feel like this person. 
person never meant to hurt you with um like pushing you away. Or how they just made it seem like it was just, you know, whatever to them. This person wants to be in a relationship. I want to marry you. When I say they see a life, they see a life. Somebody sees a huge life with you. It's ridiculous. Okay. I feel like this person gets a lot of um, messages about you. Some of y'all can see this person's name a lot. There's something like there's something about messages. It's letting you know that this is coming near. This is soon. Like somebody's gonna reach out soon. You just saw his name go across the TV. That's crazy. What's up? I'm well. How are you? Hey. I'm good, Tina. Thank you for asking. All right. What else, Holy Spirit? Okay. I'm sorry. I'm just not ready. Whoa, that's too much. Okay. So when it came to... Oh, that's too much. Okay. So when it came to... Maybe someone had brought up being exclusive or something like that. And someone wasn't ready. feel like this person may not be where they want to be when it comes to offering commitment yeah they're just doing a lot of thinking they're wondering um if you've been thinking about them <laughs> they feel like you're the best thing that that's ever happened to them Ooh. Not count me out by Shay Jennifer trying to just pop their little ass out. Cause yeah. So I feel like you taught this stuff. Do you taught this person something? You taught this person something. I don't know. Well, it gives this energy of maybe you can settle for whatever it is that they were offering you, and you just kind of you know step your foot back or something like that. Savage rival eyes. I don't know, but you're talking some type of lesson here. Right, what else? Oh, shit. Ain't your ex. Got you. So you could have taught this person, like, not everybody is your past. Not everybody is out to get you. Like, you don't have to be so cold and distant. You don't have to be, like, so on guard. <laughs> you know? Yeah, spin voucher just came out. Mm. So, I feel like this person may have... Um, 
pictured you with other people and baby baby somebody ain't like it i don't think this person liked what they seen <laughs> they didn't like what they're seeing i feel like this person was really convinced that they didn't deserve you in some type of way They've been talking to their friends about you. Hmm. They've been, they told their friends about how you make them feel. Oh, wow. Okay. They out here telling their friends and shit. All right, what else? <laughs> Not love by music, so child. Yeah. This person is realizing just how much you mean to them. Or they went through that. And that's the lesson. Okay. As well as along with not comparing people to your past or thinking people is all out to get you or it's going to always be a repeat. Like you're teaching this person a lot. Not I love you. Jesus. Okay, what else? Mean what you say by Eric Bellinger. So I feel like this person's gonna want to apologize because it's coming out right on top of the I never meant to hurt you card. And I feel like it's gonna be a very sincere and genuine apology from this person. Okay. Tell me more. So then, giving in, coming in with a sincere apology, eh? We love that. We love a sincere apology. I don't know. Something about the energy is just real, real, real calm. Like, real calm. I miss you is here. Okay, so this person definitely misses you, your presence. So now I can see the number 202. I feel like they could have told their friends about how you're nothing like their ex and how you're just like everything and that they miss you. this stuff I feel like this person is wondering if you miss them too do you make me want to love again mm -hmm. yeah so you kind of uh, cracked open somebody's heart shocker. You got their little heart beating again, okay? You got somebody all up in their little emotions and their feelings. <laughs> feelings. <laughs> ah. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. Too many, too many, too many, too many. This is cute energy. Oh, thank you. This is really cute energy. Yeah, so this person is hoping you don't hold no grudge against them because of what happened, because how they were moving due to the fact that they was acting real shifty because they were past and shit like that. You know, so they could have kind of projected a little bit on you and the connection, and it could have just fucked shit up, you know? And they just really hope that you don't hate them for that. Yeah, they want to know, can you find it in your heart to forgive them? 
Uh, this person wants to start over. This person wants to start over. Drive by by Eric Bellinger is here again. I feel like this person is not going to call you or text you because they don't want to get like ignored or wait for your response or something like that. I feel like this person is going to pull up. Or if you are ignoring this person's calls or text, they're going to pull up on you. <laughs> so just know that. <laughs> All right, yeah, because somebody ain't playing about you, spin about you is out here. Like they can't ignore i feel like this person can't ignore the signs that they're getting about you okay it's the way that you make this person feel is out of this world all right give me some more holy spirit yeah they know that you're disappointed in them <laughs> for sure they know i feel like they've been telling their friends all the tea like all the tea then I tell you they have some insecurities here too because that I'm intimidated by you card just came out. You're way out of my league. So their friends could be, I don't know if their friends are saying this or if this person is telling their friends that I feel like she's out of my league or da 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 da. But I really hope this person works through their insecurities. But it looks like they might. I'm going to get a couple more and see. I know what you want from me. I'm just scared to give it to you. Yeah, this person knows that you mean a lot to them and they know exactly what you want. But it scares this person. I heard heebie-jeebies. Somebody just said heebie-jeebies. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! They let access game, though. But show, damn. Hold on, man. The sex game is crazy, okay? They fuss with that. They missed that for sure. Yeah, they want to come back. I feel like this person's going to figure out a way to get back to you. Yeah, it's hard for being away from you. Just pop out. So I'm going to put it back. But yeah, that's just, you know, confirmation of what I just said. <laughs> this person can't stay being away from you. God damn. Calm down. Yeah, somebody doesn't want to be done. So I feel like this person is going to ask you, how do you feel? Is this something that you can move past? Overall energy. Let's see, overall energy, how they feel. Oh, they want to be in a relationship. <laughs> I love you at the top of the deck with I listen to your favorite song to feel closer to you at the bottom of the deck. And underneath that is I want to meet up and talk. This person feels like you're moving away from them. They know they'll lose you if they can't fuck around and get over their past. There's something about thinking about the last time that you guys were with each other. Something about the... Uh, the last connection or something like that. Whatever the last time you guys connected or possibly seeing each other. Alright. I've got that card for me. Damn. Ooh. Yeah, this person dreams about you a lot, especially about being in a relationship. I don't know if they're actually daydreaming or if they're having actual dreams, but it's something about dreaming about being in a relationship with you for sure. Damn. They don't want you to blame yourself for whatever that happened because they want you to know it was not you. You don't need to be looking at yourself like you did something wrong, which I don't think y'all did. But, you know. Okay. 
I'm gonna put a ring on it when I get when the time is right. Sorry. I felt that energy come out. Yeah, they dream about that a lot. Like for sure. Some of y'all can be getting a lot of telepathic communication from this person about them wanting to be in a relationship with you or something like that. I feel like this space is temporary. <laughs> like you have no idea. I'm only staying here for my kids just came out as well. I also feel for a little I feel for I'm getting a down a download, so I'm gonna say it because it's poking at me and it may not resonate for all y'all, but it's gonna resonate for some. Um but there's something about um uh, maybe this this person possibly um being in a relationship at one point in time. Um and I feel like it went from being in a relationship with someone to them only wanting to co-parent with whoever it is that they're with or will have children with so maybe somebody thought they were going to end up with the person that they're gonna um that they had kids with and stuff like that somebody could have thought that they were going to work it out with them to only have met you and now this person is in the energy of like trying to get out of that situation because they want to be with you <laughs> And it like um so timelines could have got crossed and stuff like that. That's only for some, so don't forget if it don't resonate. And what else? Twin flames. So there's gonna definitely be a twin flame journey. There's too many. Um, for others of y'all, this person just dreams about, you know, being in a relationship with you, like I said. and um, But they do have a little situation where they have to take care of their kids and stuff like that. So, I do feel like this person is going to do what they need to do as a father. Um, but they're being very strategic in order to be able to do it all, okay? To offer whatever it is that they wanted to offer. But this person has been, <laughs> earlier there, this person was trying to be in denial about this connection, about how they feel, how strongly it is. This person is going mad crazy without you. Like, this person wants to see you so bad. If y'all haven't seen each other, this person wants to see you so fucking bad. Like, bad. <laughs> bad. Somebody wants to see you hella bad. Yeah. This person is keeping tabs on you. Okay. And I also feel like it's definitely giving, especially energetically. They're especially keeping tabs on you energetically. I really feel like you see random shit about this person that just reminds you. It'd be the most specific shit. You'd be like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I'm trying to mind my business. And every time I try to mind my business, bitch, here you come. Like, I cannot escape you. <laughs> like, somebody feel like I cannot escape this person's energy. Like, it, yeah. Because they're energetically stalking you. Mm -hmm. They can't be with you in the physical. So they do all they can to stay with you energetically. <laughs> <laughs> and they hope it makes you want to reach out like like boy or girl you better reach out if you you better stop acting like you don't care somebody be pretending just a little bit too hard and it's just like baby stop doing that stop doing that stop fucking pretending you be re pretending a little bit too hard like you don't really give a fuck like that and you care tremendously you care tremendously like stop stop acting like that stop acting like that don't don't even do that 
Don't do that. Please don't do that. Pick your balls up. Pick your balls up. <laughs> Pick your fucking balls up. That's all I'm saying. Let's give one more card. That's all I'm saying. Collector, pick your fucking balls up, bro. All right. Karmic partner interference. Now, it doesn't have to necessarily be a partner. It can just be anything, okay? It could be the person's mindsets. It can be their fears, um, okay? It can just be this person being all up in their head, which is keeping them being stagnant, whatever, it can just be them. And for some of y'all, it is possibly a person. Like I said, put your stuff where it resonates. This is a general, and I'm reading for a lot of y'all, okay? A lot of y'all. Right. So somebody can just be trying to get them. Inf- oh, not truth is. <laughs> I'm in love with you. Yeah, we know, boo. Mm-hmm. We know already. We just waiting for you to come out and say that shit. Anyways, I feel like somebody can be trying to block this connection in some type of way. But I don't think it's going to continue to happen. What's at the top? I love variety, but there's something about you I just can't resist. Yeah, this person may have thought that they wanted other people and stuff like that as well. They may have thought that they wanted a roster, but... They were not happy with having a roster. Somebody couldn't stop thinking about you. Somebody couldn't stop wanting to be with you. It's every time they were with somebody else, they thought about you. Like nobody really ha nobody has this person. You're the one that has this person. You have this person's heart. You have this person's mind. You have their loins or whatever it is that's between their legs. You have it all. Somebody is not moved by other people. They don't like it. So somebody doesn't just, I feel like somebody doesn't bother with it anymore. They miss you too much. I'm just, I'm hearing that song, um, Soul Tide remix, um, by Savannah Christina, and I'm hearing the lyric where she says, um, I, what she said, I tried to pass the time by pulling up on other niggas or something like that, um, it's like, I tried, but it, it it's a no. Somebody tried. Somebody tried to pull up on other people. Somebody tried to dip and dabble with other people. But it just... <laughs> it's a no. Somebody no. I tried. Shit, you probably tried too. Like, uh, I'm going to try to pull up on this guy. Or I'm going to try to, you know, allow this guy to take me out. Or da 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 It's a no. It's a no. It's it's a hell no. It's a no. All right. Let's get three cards from here and three cards from my other deck. And we'll end this out with some initials. If you are on my YouTube watching this and you have not yet liked the video, like the fucking video. <laughs> Feel like I gotta threaten YouTube, like <laughs> TikTok family. I don't have no issues with y'all. YouTube, I gotta threaten them. I don't know what it is. I was on my live earlier today. Like, if you didn't like this video, I hope it didn't resonate. <laughs> I hope it didn't resonate for you. <laughs> no, I'm playing. No, I'm playing. But look, like is free. This. It, it, the video is free. The reading is free. The least I can do is, you know, exchange me with a like. You feel me? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. You feel me? That's all I'm saying. I love y'all. It's all love at the end of the day. <laughs> all right. Give me a couple messages from this person, Holy Spirit. Okay. 
I'm trying to understand myself more and it's in reverse. So I feel like this person has done enough contemplation, enough thinking, enough trying to figure themselves out. They know exactly what's going on. They know they... Ooh, somebody has a hard time think us talking though. What the fuck? No, babe. They know that they let you down though. Okay. And I feel like if you thought this person really gave you false hopes, they didn't give you false hopes. It's just they weren't available at the time. They just weren't in the energy to give you what you needed. And this person feels so bad because they wish that they would have treated you better during that time. Okay, let's put one more card in here. I feel like things are about to speed up with y'all because they can't stop thinking about you. And I, I feel like this person is getting out of this energy of taking it slow. Like, I feel like this person has identified that it's their anxiety. They have identified that it's them needing to heal from past shit and stuff like that. They have identified that. And I feel like they have identified that you fuck with them. <laughs> you know? So it's like... Why come in and take it slow afterwards? <laughs> All right, give me one. Give me two cards from here. I say, actually. Give me two. Give me two. Give me two. Give me two. <clears throat> I'm hearing that song again. I saw the sign. Uh, 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 I saw the sign. <laughs> so yeah, check out. Um, oh, that's only for subscribers. Never mind. So it, this reading may um, resonate with my subscribers for sure. My subscribers here on TikTok. That exclusive content that I released yesterday. I channeled that song. It just popped up again. So. This reading may be for you, for sure. Romance, Cupid, Arrow, Strikes. So there's definitely an enlightenment happening. Love that. Deep in your heart, you already know the answer. Do what, feel, do what feels right. Exactly. This person, I keep, t they know. This person knows now. They fucking know. They know. So now it's just all up to them to make the room, the um, the moves and shit like that. Somebody knows what to do. They know where their heart is and all that. This is beautiful. One more card. One more card. One more card, please. Forgiveness. Stop focusing your energy on past events, for life is too precious to waste. You create your reality by what you think, dream, and imagine. What I tell you? Ah, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Period. Bottom of the deck. Secret admirer. Someone has deeper feelings for you than they're letting on. What I say? What are we saying? Stop playing. Freedom at the top. There is nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. So like I said, this person knows what to do. It's just up to them. It's up to them to make the move. It's up to them to get out of their own way. That's it. And I think they about to move out their own way, you know? They might just about to move out their own way, then, you know? Yeah, okay, let's get two cords in here. <laughs> What's up, man? Damn, a card that fell out off. Best self, that's what I... 
That's what I'm talking about. And inspiration at the bottom of the deck. That's what I'm talking about. You inspired this person to look at themselves. You inspired this person to do right. You inspired this person to want to... Okay, look. What did I do? What the fuck is wrong with me? Like, you had them just like, hmm. You make me think a lot, smart guy. <laughs> That's the energy you giving. You make me think a lot, smart guy. That's what it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, shit. <clears throat> what you thought? Learning. Learning. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Afraid came out in reverse. We love that. We love that. We love that. Okay, so this person will be communicating. Okay. In the meantime, send this person love, healing. Okay. Positive energy. Because this person will be coming forth to let you know what's up. Period. Okay. Anything else, Holy Spirit? I do want to pull from here. Let's do a couple from here. Oh shit, I thought drop my name tag. And then that'll be it. Mm -hmm. Yes, continue to pray for your baby. Cause he getting it together, okay? Alright, Holy Spirit. Let's get a few messages and then we'll get some initials. I hope you are enjoying this reading. My heart belongs to you by Joda C. Period. My heart belongs to you. Ah! Whatever you need. Period. Okay. What's up? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Everything about you is different from others, and I like it. Mm -hmm. I love that. Okay. Look, I'm done repeating myself. Period. Mm -hmm. They're done going in the circle like they was doing. They, they tired of that shit. You're getting everything that you want. Know that. Know you're getting everything that you want, collective. You're getting every little thing that you want, baby. Yeah. Can I take you out? So this person is going to want to take you out. Okay. Somebody want to ask you out on a date. Okay. CLB. So that can be somebody's first, middle, or last name. Could it even be their initials? Popping out married to each other. Hard launch. Okay. So if y'all been ready to get in a relationship and stuff like that, if that's something that you just been really banking on, you're getting everything that you want. That's underneath that. My cash app is Queen Curly Hair. Queen Curly Hair. I appreciate those of you who be sending in tips and donations and book it with me and stuff like that i love y'all all right it's 111 on my clock right now i got people in my ear about you mm. i feel like it's good things because it's coming up underneath everything about you is different from others and i like it so you got somebody like damn i want to take her out like the letter f You make me nervous. Mm. Did I mention that here? Or did I mention that in my other life? I don't know. But I do remember saying that somebody makes somebody nervous. So, yeah. Oh, thank you for the tip, babe. I appreciate you. Please, can I come back? So they want to know, like, what's up? I'm ready to get this done. Grind on me by Pretty Ricky. <clears throat> so 
Some of y'all could be really worried about y'all right now. Okay. I swore I knew what real love was until you came along. Ooh. Do you still care for me? Okay. And like I said, I'm worried about me right now. So I feel like this person is doing whatever it is that they need to do. Okay. I do feel like this person is not um, in the energy of giving their body away or anything like that. They're definitely worried about them because this person wants to get out of the cycle. Okay. Indiana can be significant in the city. You've been distant lately. So this person feels like you've been di distant. But I feel like you, as just like they're focused on, your, focused on them, you're focused on yourself. Your thoughts are safe with me. Okay, so this person feels safe enough to tell you anything. Playing both of y'all in tandem. Yeah, somebody is done doing stupid shit like that. Somebody used to have a roster and shit like that. Somebody's like, I'm not doing that shit. I gave you the bare minimum because I wasn't sure about us, but I am now. Okay, so that's on top of you're getting everything that you want. Do, 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 do. Using the kids as a pawn. So somebody can be fucking around. Look, we brought up that whole baby mama shit. Somebody, you know, uh, staying there for only their kids. And it's making it hard on being able to take you out and shit like that. Because somebody keeps using these damn kids to scare this man or this woman to get them to do what they want to do. So somebody is in a manipulative um, co-parenting situation. Oh no, I've been combed. Copycats jocking your style. So somebody can be jocking your style, baby, trying to be you and shit. <laughs> the fool is here. Love that. That's on top of popped out married to each other. Hard launch. So yeah, somebody's gonna fuck around and uh possibly even a loaf. The letter D. I didn't mean to hurt you, or I didn't mean to let you down. I'm sorry, I made up my own little words, but I feel like that's what they're saying still. <clears throat> high standards. So this person knows that you have high standards, and that's what makes them nervous because they know they got to be, <laughs> they got to step up to the plate. They got to be on your level. They're going to come fuck with you. Hustle mentality. Okay. So I feel like somebody's in grind mode right now, especially when it comes to getting you back. For sure. All right, damn, I'll admit it. I ran because I got scared of my feelings. So somebody's definitely going to admit that they ran away because of how scary it was to fall for you. And again, they know you have high standards. <laughs> Can't be fucking around. Let's build an empire, uh, empire together. Power couple. Ooh. Okay. So this person is getting into the energy of let's go ahead and do this. Why not? You're everything I've dreamed of anyways. Look, you always show up for me. This person knows that you can count on them at all times. Like there's no question in their mind. Last one, Iowa, Idaho, in the city. Since that was a state, let's just go ahead and get another one. This person can want to travel with you. Let me take care of you. Yeah, so once this person get their shit straight, they gonna want to come and take care of you, baby. Okay? They gonna want to do, make it do what they do. So allow them to continue to get their shit straight. Let's get some initials and some random confirmations that will link the viewers to this reading for those they resonate with or those who message it belongs to. <clears throat> I'm 
I'm saying the word best. Best mister. Someone who wants to be the best husband, okay? Someone who's working on being the best person for you. Okay, someone loves having fun with you. There's also something about uh, Pac-Man. I'm saying best, do it. <laughs> okay, yeah, somebody for sure wants to marry somebody. Like, this is, this is um, evident for sure. Somebody's first name can start with a T. TJ is here. Something about a cape. A cape? I don't know. Somebody can have pets. Something about a, a cape, though. Um, a cage. Something about a cage. Something about a pea coat as well. Enough. I'm seeing the words enough. Oh shit. Somebody is really okay. So somebody is getting into the energy of feeling enough for you. You're teaching somebody how to feel fulfilled, feel feel like they're enough. I'm seeing that you are a good enough card in my third eye on my um my moonology. I'm curious. Where is this deck at? Um, what else am I seeing? A new romantic cycle begins. Just when y'all thought something was not going to happen with this connection, you're wrong. You are so wrong. The answers you need are coming. So everything that you've been waiting on to know about what's going on between you and this person or whatever it is, you're going to get it all. So um, I feel like you're going to get emotional. Some of y'all may have been a little bit stressed about this connection. I feel like this person's been a little bit um, getting worked up about giving you the answers. Yeah, this person is releasing negativity surrounding um, letting you know how they feel. <laughs> Somebody has very, very strong feelings for y'all. Y'all have no idea. Also, somebody has the name Joey. Joey. Somebody could be a junior as well. I'm also hearing Jerome. What do you need to release? Okay. Somebody's name can be Robert. Oh, shit. There's too many. Stop playing. Bring love into the situation. Okay. Yeah, so somebody's going to let their, their guard down. Yeah, confidence is your key to success and personal issue reaches resolution. So this person, like I said, this person getting over their anxiety, gaining the confidence that they need to feel good enough to even um, go towards this connection. This person is surrendering. They're surrendering to their emotions. They're surrendering to what's going on between y'all. Like, I feel like they're surrendering. And I feel like you need to surrender too. Nothing yet is set in stone and adjustments are required. So this person is still making their much needed adjustments. Or the, um, that's why things were where it's at because adjustments were needed. But know that things are not going to be how they are. Somebody's really coming forward. Yep, don't let pride get in your way. Ha <laughs> ha, show me the real you at the bottom of the deck and the end of a tough cycle. Um, 
approach you. So yeah, it's this person stepping into their authenticity, stepping into their feelings of how they feel for you. Okay, not allowing that to um, keep them back. It's something about you being the best to ever do it, because that's what I'm saying. Best to do it, like best to ever do it. <laughs> it's. Mm -hmm. Somebody can have on a pair of jorts or like to wear jorts. Yeah, all right. Let's get the initials of this person, please. Uh, something about a camper. So maybe somebody likes to go camping. Somebody could have a um, um, an RV or something like that. <clears throat> I don't know. All right. What's the initials of this person? that this is coming from. Takin. <laughs> Somebody could have had a PO. Been on probation before. Somebody definitely want to seal the deal with you. And I'm hearing every kiss begins with K. Somebody feels like they owe you so much. You have no idea. It's something about the way that you showed up for this person when they couldn't even show up for you. I'm hearing you deserve it all. Sheesh. All right. Um, Samaje. Something about jet skis. So somebody can want to jet ski, um, want to take you to the beach and take you on jet skis. Something about jet skis. Something about seals. It's definitely like going to a beach or going somewhere near water or something like that. Somebody can live in Virginia. But I feel like this is something about a paid vacation. Somebody is going to, I keep picking that up. Like, I don't know, y'all. Somebody about to take somebody on a fucking all expense paid vacation. Like, it's something. Mm. But whatever you were thinking about this connection, I'm here to say psych. <laughs> psych. I'm here to say psych right now. Psych. <laughs> That's why I'm going to name this reading. <laughs> psych. You thought you were going to get what you want. <laughs> psych. <laughs> psych. <laughs> psych. That's funny as fuck. <laughs> Oh my god yo that is hilarious okay let me read off these these uh initials and then i'm gonna end it out all right okay so we have f h e d o e again a p v i u t z r e K I S <laughs> uh, E A L H J T G. All right. That is what we have. And I'm hearing the word Jetson. <sighs> mm hmm. Some of y'all could uh, like the Jetsons because I'm seeing um, Jane take um, Mr. Jetson's wallet <laughs> when she's like, and he's like trying to get money out of it. And she takes the whole wallet and kiss him and then leaves and go shopping. Like, I feel like that's going to be y'all. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, 
No, give me that. Thank you. Bye. Love you. <laughs> ah, so cute. But yeah. <clears throat> Some of y'all can also have like a, a handshake with this person or something like that. And somebody can like to smoke or vape or something. But yeah, that's all I have for y'all today. If you like this reading, you know what to do. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you already haven't. Share this message with someone you feel may need to hear it, especially if you are watching this from YouTube. You can if you're on TikTok Live. I mean, you know. But yeah. Um, continue to help your girl get to 5,000 subscribers because once I get there, I will be getting y'all two free readings. Giving it away. Two personals. Okay. In the meantime, I love y'all. I'll see y'all soon. You know to book with me. Click the link in the bio to do that. Okay.